Hello. Um, okay. So we've just come out from a very interesting technology panel where we talked about uh, technology's impact on society and culture. So here is my question. What do you think about the technology impact on economy, especially the Greek economy? Has it created any new growth drivers for Greek for Greece? Well, the truth is, by using new technologies, you can actually improve the quality of life of your citizens and the economy itself. I wish we had done that. The problem is that we haven't yet. So the bureaucracy that could be reduced by using new technologies would save us billions of money that are being spent for bureaucracy. And also the hidden cost of our transactions, this could actually be removed. This means we have a hundred and more billion of euros spending for transactions with the banks or with the public sector. Imagine if we got just reduce that 10-20%, we would save a huge amount of money to redistribute and give it back to the citizens. So you're a member of the European Union. Tell us about your vision of the European continent and where do you want to lead this continent into as well as your country, Greece? Well, since we have a dialogue of civilizations and we are at a crossroad, Greece is a crossroad for civilizations, I would say that Europe has to be this crossroad where you can find peace and democracy and it can be a heaven of trust. I do believe we can achieve that in Europe, so this means we have to keep open minds open dialogue and try to work uh, in uh, our best behavior with our neighbors and globally to succeed and have diplomacy and have also a global perspective and a strategy of the role that Europe can play globally again. So I think uh, this is uh, my vision not just for Europe but also for Greece because Greece is uh, also at the northern border, at the southern borders of, uh, of Europe. This means it will play an essential role for the Mediterranean area, for energy, for, uh, for the sun belt but also